Hey, what's going on guys? Clutch here and Farming Simulator 23 is now here. We're looking at, well, the two different versions. We've got, of course, the Nintendo Switch version and the mobile version. And we're gonna take a look at, well, the differences between those in this video. Now, as far as options go, there's only a couple of things that are different. The game themselves, the fundamentals of the games, they are identical. However, there's a couple of things you may wanna know about that are different between the two of them. First of all, the Nintendo Switch version, the graphical settings are locked. You can adjust them. However, on the mobile version of the game for well, iOS and Android devices, well, you can change the graphical fidelity based on whatever hardware you're running. So depending on the hardware you're running, if it's a brand new iPhone or maybe an older Android device or vice versa, you can change that between low all the way up to very high. There's four different settings you can change in there. And the other difference, the mobile version once again has coins which can be purchased, which will give you in-game currency. So you can well, buy more equipment faster in game. And also the mobile version of the game has micro transactions for some equipment. Unfortunately, a lot of this equipment tends to be the bigger or better equipment. So you will actually have to buy some of this equipment first to unlock it with real money. The Nintendo Switch version, of course, does not have either of those. You don't have any money transactions or micro transactions whatsoever with the Nintendo Switch version. So the rest of this video is going to be a comparison between the Nintendo Switch version of Farming Simulator 23, as well as the mobile version of Farming Simulator 23. And we're going to be running the mobile version on both a third generation iPad Pro, as well as an iPhone 11, a little bit of an older generation iPhone. So we can kind of get a comparison. I'm going to be setting the uh, display to quality or the hardware quality to very high on both the iOS devices. So we could check that out. And uh, yeah, we'll just go through them and take a look and compare the different uh, the different graphical qualities of all three of these components. Drop, uh, drop a comment, comment down below on which version you're gonna get. And let me know guys, here we go. 